What is going on guys, my name is 4G or on this channel, Mr. Supply Drops. Today we are going to be talking about how Warzone has completely butchered Call of Duty Zombies. Now if you are a Warzone player, you love Warzone, I'm not hating on your opinion. This is aimed at Activision for how they have treated Call of Duty Zombies has been terrible ever since the Warzone era. I don't care if you thought Cold War Zombies was good, it is nowhere near as good as Black Ops 3, Black Ops 2, Black Ops 1. Nowhere near is good. Cold War Zombies, especially because of the maps, was a watered down version of all of those different games. I'd say even Black Ops 4 was more enjoyable in my opinion. It felt more like a zombies game. They were still trying to make it a zombies experience, whereas this has always been, you could see a massive shift. It blended zombies and Warzone or multiplayer, whatever, but either way, it blended zombies and Warzone together. We have a mini map now. We have a health bar on all the zombies. We have a name tag sometimes. Like, do I really need to see that it says zombie as their name? Like, why do I have to go into the settings and turn that off? Like, that shouldn't even be a thing from the beginning. It just should not be a thing. And then there's also the fact you spawn in with a loadout, just like it's goddamn Warzone. The game had been watered down incredibly so, so that Warzone players could enjoy the game. People who just typically would only play free-to-play Battle Royale kind of games. Well, now we're going from Fortnite to Warzone to now Call of Duty Zombies, but this is not real Call of Duty Zombies. And here's why it's so upsetting. It's because it's only gotten worse. We had Vanguard Zombies after, and we all know how bad that was. I'm not even to go into that that was just cold war mechanics and somehow worse because it wasn't even round based and i know they did make it round based later on but only one map was decent and it was shinonuma and that's already a remade map that we've seen so many times and it's shinonuma why have, out of every map did they pick that shinonuma is trash in comparison to pretty much everything else it is probably the worst classic zombies map in my opinion but anyways moving forward modern warfare zombies now they kind of tried a little tiny bit with this but it's still you can see how rushed it was. Now, I'm not even exactly blaming the developers in this situation. I'm sure they just had to spit something out as fast as possible. But whoever pushed the idea of getting a game mode like this out for zombies instead of just doing what we know works and is what the community demands. This is a video game here. Modern Warfare Zombies was fun for a little bit. I'll give it that, all right? I will give it that. While you're completing the story missions and all of that for the first time, tiers one through three, it is fun. But at the end of the day, it is still just zombies pasted onto the war zone map. And it's just so disgusting how lazy it has become, man. I wouldn't even be surprised if in Black Ops Gulf War, the zombie maps that we do get in that game are just going to be splices from the Warzone map that whatever brand new Warzone map we get at that time. I'm sure they'll drop something eventually, right? Or, like, or sections of Verdansk or something, because I know they're going to bring back Verdansk at some point soon. Uh, so it's just like, I wouldn't be surprised. They are very lazy when it comes to that stuff. And I understand it's a lot of stuff to, uh, you know, make and add and do all this stuff. There's so many new game modes and stuff they have to add but guess what all right i don't give a damn i'm the one who is paying you money for this game all right that's not my worry also you have like 30 different studios working on this shit whereas before it was like four smaller studios and then like infinity ward was like the main i could be wrong about that either way the point is they have a ton of studios all working together on these games nowadays okay how do you not have enough people to make actual good quality content and get it out there with all these game modes I I don't get it. Your Activision Blizzard pay for more people. Oh, wait, that would cost money. Shit, I forgot about that. But anyways, Warzone has completely ruined Call of Duty Zombies. It's ruined Call of Duty in general. I mean, we've removed the prestige system because of this. Uh, we have lower quality maps in Cold War Zombies, for example, because we don't have map packs anymore. I know people don't like map packs, but I'm going to be real. I'd rather have good content and that I have to pay for than trash content and not get any good content that is free. Like, it just doesn't make any sense to me. Like, if you don't want to pay for it, do you really want this trash to play? I, I don't know, whatever. Because, like, let's be real. Uh, Firebase E, terrible. I don't even remember the rest of the maps. Anyways, point is, Warzone has completely butchered Call of Duty Zombies, man. And it's just a damn shame. It really is. Because I don't think that Gulf War is going to be any better. I really don't. I Here's a theory right here. Here's just a guess. A couple months in, this is the end of April 2024 right now. This is before they announced the game at all, all right, let alone a trailer for zombies or anything like that. But my guess here is that the game is going to be exactly, exactly like Cold War Zombies. Just 
tiny bits of difference. Maybe they change the field upgrades or they add a perk difference or here or there. It's going to be exactly the same because we can't get away from this Cold War bullshit that they keep putting in the game. Modern Warfare Zombies have the same thing. I am just tired of this. Can we get real zombies again? Black Ops 4, as mid as that game was, it at least felt like a Call of Duty Zombies game, alright? I don't care what anyone has to say about that game. It is better than Cold War just because it actually felt like... It feels like a higher quality game than Cold War, than Modern Warfare Zombies, than, and especially Vanguard, alright? Feels way higher of quality. And yeah, you can say, well, you had to pay 50 bucks for the Black Ops Pass to get all the rest of the maps. I mean, you don't really have to. You don't have to get those maps. There was four maps on launch. That is the entirety of Cold War for free, and they're all garbage. Whereas, at least in Black Ops 4, you got them for free on day one, and then they added more that you could pay for if you wanted to. So, we're not limited to just four. It's just, man, I miss when Call of Duty was at least decent. Like, it hasn't been fantastic since the Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3 days, but I miss when it was at least pretty solid. Even Black Ops 3 had its flaws with the supply drop system and all that, but... Regardless, I don't have anything else to really say about this anymore. It's just, I miss Call of Duty Zombies, man. I, I'm so tired of having to just play Black Ops 3 all the time because there's custom zombies, and that's like the only way you get any new content from a Call of Duty Zombies game anymore. And it has to be made by the community because the developers, they have this Warzone idea shoved so far up their own ass. I, I don't understand what the point of it is, man. Get rid of this Warzone trash, man. Or at least keep it, just keep them separate. You don't need to combine them all. You don't need to mix them. Zombies used to feel separate, man. If used to feel like its own brand new game mode. Every time you got on the game, you would have campaign, multiplayer, zombies, all separate games. It didn't feel like they were all just one. Like, it was technically one game, of course, but it didn't feel like that. It felt like its own separate experience every time you jumped into one of these different modes, alright? And campaign, that's another thing. I'm not gonna get into that too much, but they even got lazy with that with Modern Warfare 3. I don't exactly blame them. Uh, with, you know, I don't exactly blame Sledgehammer in this situation because they had to rush the game. I blame Activision for having them rush the game. But I will say, regardless of what happened or how it is, they even got lazy, literally lazy. If you're rushing, you have to do some, you don't have the time to actually make a, a real campaign. They have these lazy assets all over the game where you're just on the Warzone map again and these little snippets, man. And it's, it's so obvious. They don't even try to hide it. And it's just, ah, oh, man. It's like the multiplayer is fun. If I didn't have fun with the multiplayer, I'd just stop playing Call of Duty in general anymore. I'm going to be completely real because Zombies is awful multiplayer is even multiplayer is flawed but at least it's still fun like i said campaign i hate to say this but infinity ward is like no nah, actually that's not true i was gonna say they're on they're only ones who make good campaigns nowadays but uh cold war was all right cold war was all right the campaign i liked it i liked it but regardless i'm gonna end this video it's very hot in here uh and i'm gonna go uh turn the fan on and uh cool down because it's like 90 degrees out or some shit in April. But anyways, that's going to wrap up this video. If you guys enjoyed it, like it would be greatly appreciated. If you're new here and you like videos like this, make sure to that subscribe button down below. Now, thank you so much for watching. Have a great day.